During the winter months, it's not just ice and snow that make our roads slippery and difficult to drive on. Even cold and damp conditions can make driving a dangerous task. Thankfully though, tyre manufacturers have designed winter tyres to provide much better grip and safety in all of these conditions, helping you to avoid any unnecessary and unpleasant accidents. At temperatures below 7 degrees, summer tyres become hard and are less able to key into the road surface. Winter tyres are made from a special tread compound, which stays flexible in cold conditions. This is so the tyre can lock into the peaks and troughs of the road surface and grip the road better. They also have more small grooves or sipes, which provide better grip in wet, icy or snowy conditions. To demonstrate the difference between winter and summer tyres, we're going to carry out two tests. The first is a braking test, which will show clearly the difference in stopping distances for the two tyres. The second is a cornering test, which will show how effective the different tyres are at gripping in cold conditions. So, let's show the difference with two virtually identical Skoda Yetis except the red Yeti is fitted with standard summer tyres and the blue with winter tyres, designed to provide better grip and safety when temperatures drop below 7 degrees C. In wintry conditions, even to get a car moving can be difficult. Here our car struggles for grip and when a driver gets up to 15 miles per hour and reaches our marker, he slams on the brakes. On summer tyres, it takes 10.36 metres to come to a stop. Now the Blue Yeti, fitted with winter tyres, which is designed to provide much better grip in the cold. Much better grip at the start line, and this time, it only takes the car 6.71 metres to come to a stop. As this split screen shows, the Red Yeti, fitted with summer tyres, took more than a full car length to come to a stop. And remember, this was at just 15 miles per hour. Imagine the difference in potential damage if sudden braking was needed on a busy main road when speeds are much faster. Now for cornering. Both Yetis are going to try and drive through this simple bend at a speed of just 15 miles per hour. First off, it's the red car fitted with standard summer tyres. As the car enters the bend, its front tyres lose grip with the road surface, leading to massive understeer. This is harmless enough on our ice rink, but imagine the consequences if this was a real road, with the car drifting into the path of an oncoming vehicle. Now for the winter tyres. Again, we can see that when the blue Yeti starts off, the driver has much better traction and control, helping him to get up to speed much quicker. And through the cones safely, wow, what a difference. Much better grip and complete control on the winter tyres. Let's see the difference again from the overhead camera. And this angle shows what a big difference tyres make. So, the same entry speed, the winter tyres guide the driver safely around the corner, while the car equipped with summer tyres loses control and ploughs straight on. So remember, winter tyres are not just for driving in Arctic conditions. They work much better than summer tyres at temperatures below 7 degrees C, giving better grip, stability and safety, making them an ideal choice for the whole winter period. For more information about winter tyres or tyre safety, please visit www.skoda.co.uk or contact your local Skoda retailer.